Yo, what's good? Finally using a mic on my PC and recordings. So yeah, we're gonna start this little RP series. You know, I had to finally get into this. So, what better place to start off with a little uh with a little ride? So let's go ahead and take a look at that ride. Yes, sir. We got a nice little uh, Ford Explorer over here. Uh, this is this is kind of my neighborhood. Uh, I just moved in recently, so yeah. Um, <laughs> my apologies. For the horrible area that I live in. I'm planning on moving pretty soon here. But uh, yeah, this is my uh, Ford Explorer. Uh, 2013. I bought it uh, probably two years ago. I'm thinking about trading this in sometime soon, but it, we're currently in the year of uh, 2014, and uh, I heard a little rumors that there was a car, a special car that I wanted to get, and uh, I don't know, it was just a really nice car, but I'm going to make my way over to the dealership, and uh, we're going to take a look at that ride and see how it looks. Okay, let's go. All right, so first things first, uh, gotta make sure our seatbelt's on, cause you know there, there's cops around this area and they like to uh, pull you over if you don't have your seatbelt on. But of course we gotta drive our seatbelt on, we don't fly through the shoe. <laughs> and wow, look at that mirror. That mirror is very, very detailed. I can see everything at that mirror. All right, well, uh, let's go ahead and drive out to the uh, spot and uh, see what we can get into. Let's go ahead and drive out this little area here got the amigos over there <laughs> all right let's drive out pretty hefty on the traffic today but we should be okay and we got taken all day to move all right let's go Really busy day today. We got a 1970 Challenger right there. That looks fire. Just driving down the street casually. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna get to the uh, dealership and see how how is it going over there and see see what they have to offer. Uh, I've been wanting to go there for a while. You know, I just moved in town, so you know, it's, it's just like crazy got a lot of cars out here I, I haven't really attended uh, any meets yet but I really want to it's kind of hard to do that when you're in a whole Ford Explorer you know, you're in a whole freaking grocery getter and you're trying to go to car meets so, you know, I just want to have a car to go to nice car meets street races and stuff uh, if, if not many people probably know this but I'm pretty sure most of you do uh, I moved away from Palm City and moved into LS, which is Los Santos, uh, what I'm in right now. And uh, yeah, I basically ran away from the cops because I got wanted in my 350Z. Lots of craziness. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of crazy stuff happening in that city, so I just had to leave it. But uh, hopefully, here's a new start and uh, we can see what we can get done in this state. In this country, yeah, I'm I'm really hyped. I heard the street meet. I heard the street scenes and everything was really, really uh, intricate and well put together in this city. So hopefully, we can get to some beats and see how it runs. Fortunately, this uh, Ford Explorer has a V8 in it. This is a 2013 Explorer, so it came with the V8 option. I'm actually pretty excited about because I get to hear that V8 scream. You don't usually see a lot of cars out here though. Sometimes like when it's a really good day, you will see a lot of cars. You'll see Hellcats, you'll see Mustangs, Corvettes, all types of stuff. But today is not that day. I mean we just we just moved in, so 
I'm used to seeing like 350Zs and stuff, cars flying past, flybys, cops, because I was in that town. Uh, I'm going to go over here and go over here to this dealership and see what's going on. Pretty busy day today. <laughs> Why I say that? <laughs> it's not busy at all. There's no, there's no cars on the street, really. Listen, guys. Sometimes I, I'm, I'm really hyped. I'm in the city, bro, and I'm also really hyped. I can get into Roblox. So you probably just gonna hear me saying some, some random junk. So I really apologize for it. Got a lot of uh, Mustangs in the front here. Jesus, look at this. Mustang one, Mustang two. Ooh, is that a GT five hundred? And is that is that my truck over there or my SUV? We're gonna have to check that out. Well, guys, the secret is now not a secret anymore. Now you've now figured out what I came here for. Say 2013, 14 GT500. Yes, I came to look for it. Let's go ahead and lock this door. So yeah, this is uh the Ford dealership. And look at my neat parking, y'all. Which I know about that parking. <laughs> but anyway, let's go ahead and go over here and see what they have. Uh, I'm just gonna walk past the gate if I can. I think I can, can I? Can I? Yes, I can. Okay. All right. Let's see what we got up here. We got a uh, a red explorer, kind of black explorer. You know, guys, you guys gotta remember this is uh 2014, so new cars haven't been you know put out yet. But over here we got a 2014 Shelby GT500 in the nice nice red like a cherry red and oh my god it looks so good I really want one of these bro I really want one of these honestly like the thing just looks insane like just look at how smooth like it, I don't know bro it's one thing about these S197 models it just looks so freaking nice look at that look at that heat extractor all the craziness that just pours out of this car. Like, it's just really nice. Freaking love it. Then we got Boss 302 right here in the uh, nice lime green. Looks pretty good. Interior looks fairly new. It's a stick shift. I like the front of this as well. Like the S197 models, they just look very, very nice in the front. Over here, we got another. Boss 302. This one doesn't have the black boost package, though. So. Uh, then we got looks like a V6 model. Yeah, that's a V6 model. And then you got another V6 model here. All pretty cool. So yeah, they got some nice cars. I want a lot. I can definitely say that. So let's go in the inside and see what they have. I don't think there's anybody in the front at the desk right now. Uh, let me see, is there? Nope, there's nobody in here right now, so yeah. Right here, we got a GT500 and Grabber Blue. Jesus, this thing looks insane, bro. Like, look at that engine, dude. Oh my god. Oh, it closed. Dang it. This is what happens when you get too excited over an <laughs> open hood. But this thing looks amazing. I just love this car, bro. I really want to get one. But I think y'all see the one over there in the distance. So, oh, look at it. But yeah, this right here is the special edition 2014 GT500 with a glass roof. Uh, it's got the SVT tires or rims and oh my god this thing is just insane like look like you can literally see inside of the car in the roof from the roof like it's just it's crazy bro it's literally crazy 
Like, look at that. Eva has my plate, bro. This car is calling me, dude. This car is just calling me. Alright, look at the interior of this thing. I'm not able to get inside the car because nobody works here right now. They're all in the back, but uh, when I get a chance, I'm definitely gonna like test drive this car or something. Because this car, oh my god. Comment below what you guys think about this beautiful car right here. This thing looks insane. Insane. But yeah, I don't want to get spoiled. So, let's go ahead and uh, walk out. That's all I wanted to show you guys. This nice little Ford dealership over here. Nothing really too crazy. Uh, just a lot of GT500s around, which is pretty crazy. It's one of their top, top uh, tier cars, and they just had it sitting around all over the place. I can see why they put it in the showroom, because, you know, it's that, it's that caliber, but they have one sitting out there in the lot with the other cars. It's like, wow. So let's go ahead and hop in the Explorer again. Alright, I got a few errands to run today, so, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and run them. I like this town so far, guys. I like this town. What the heck is this guy doing? Bro, what are you doing? Oh my god, this man just sitting in a red light. This man literally sat there and waited to turn red. Just, okay. I can't meet, I can't wait to meet all the new people bro. Uh gonna be pretty dope. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and uh pull in get some fuel. Gonna pull in this right here. Alright, let's go ahead and go in here and uh, pay for the pump. So what's that pump? It doesn't even have a number. Okay. Uh, just, you know, I'm just going to say I paid for LTV. <laughs> okay. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and go ahead and fill up. And... Look at what we have over here. I was literally just talking about sometimes you'll find certain cars. And look what we have over here. We have a whole Hellcat Charger. Man, this thing looks good. Dude, this thing looks insane. Oh man, I always wanted to have one of these in Palm City. If they had these if they had one of these in Palm City, bro, I would have just Guaranteed to get this before I even got the Q50. Oh my god, this thing does this. I really like that. That's, that's man, that's dope. That's dope. I really want to get one. Hopefully, when we uh, you know, start hustling, get some bread, buy stuff like that. But let's go ahead and run to the bank real quick. so sick I love it all right let's pull out these traffic lights take forever Cool. 
course there will be a meter here. Michael, I, really I really don't want to pay for a meter. I'm really close to turning Good. the corner on this. I'm just going in, uh, that is horrible. Why? Just said you'll make be our way sure. over there. Of course, we got a random cat. We're sleeping together? <laughs> Freaking alleyway cat. Got people working in there? This guy's sitting right here, like. Good, bro. How you feeling? I'm just over here to get my check. All right, guys. So now that we got my check, uh, let's see if it's clear. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and go back home. That's pretty much all I wanted to do for this uh, this little adventure. I just wanted to go to that dealership and show you guys what we had, the plans we had. I keep forgetting my keys. I want, I want, I just want to show you guys the plan we had. Basically, me buying the car, yes, going to car meets. You already know. You already know. I can't just sit here and drive around all day, every day. It's really boring. My job. I only do certain things. And, uh, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go back home. So I'll see y'all guys in the next episode. Peace.